No physical differences really between these guys. It's going to be the intangibles that decide this fight. Again, here's Bellator cage announcer Michael Williams. Live on Spike Bellator MMA tonight from Long Beach Arena now. Present the long-awaited rematch. Five five-minute rounds tonight. Main event for the Bellator Lightweight World Championship. Sanctioned by the California State Athletic Commission, Commissioner John Frierson Chair, Executive Officer is Andy Foster. This world title fight tonight is brought to you by Miller Lite, the official beer of Bellator MMA. It's not just a good time, it's Miller time. And now, first, introducing the red corner. At five foot 10, weighing in 154.5 pounds, the former Bellator lightweight world champion returns to the Bellator cage with 24 professional victories, only three defeats. Fighting out of Boca Raton, Florida, he hails from Philadelphia, PA. Introducing Eddie Alvarez. And across the cage, the champion tonight fights out of the blue corner at five foot eight, weighing in 154.8 pounds. Tonight, he enters his third title defense undefeated as a professional. 12 victories, no defeats, hailing from High Ridge, Missouri. He fights out of San Diego, California, the defending Bellator lightweight world champion, Michael Chandler. In charge of this world title fight, your referee, Big John McCarthy. Ready, Michael. Yeah, this is for the Bellator lightweight championship of the world. I want you to protect yourself at all times. Obey my commands at all times. If you want to touch the gloves, touch them now. Step back. Good luck to both of you. Good. To end all suspense, here's Michael Williams. Ladies and gentlemen, inside the Bellator cage, we go five full rounds. So we now go to your judges' scorecards. Your first judge, cage side, Mike Beltran, sees the fight 48 to 47. He sees the fight for Chandler. Your second judge, Stephen Davis, scores the fight 48 47. He sees the fight for Alvarez. Your third and final judge, Derek Cleary, scores the fight 48 to 47 for the winner by split decision for the new and now two-time Bellator right-wing world champion.